Now to a story you will only see here on Fox 35. A man who's paralyzed is without his wheelchair after it did not make his flight from Atlanta to Orlando. So he reached out to Fox 35 News for help. We made some calls and we got that man some answers. As Fox 35's Valerie Boy reports, that wheelchair is now coming home. An Orlando man who's paralyzed says he's been waiting three days for Frontier Airlines to find his missing wheelchair. They lost my chair and they didn't tell me anything. 27-year-old Asante Fournier says he has to crawl on the ground to get around because Frontier Airlines lost his wheelchair three days ago after flying from Atlanta to Orlando. They told me that we don't know where your chair is at. I was freaking out a lot because I just recently got this chair and uh, it's custom made for me. Asande, who's paralyzed from the waist down, says he's been trying to get answers. Every single time when I call Frontier, they hung up on me or they told me they're busy. He's not the only one. Frontier Airlines has an F rating with the Better Business Bureau. And that is because they have failure to respond to their complaints. According to the Better Business Bureau, Frontier Airlines has had more than 5,600 complaints in the last three years. And in the last 12 months, they've had 2,850 complaints. And of those, they have failed to respond to over 2,000 complaints. I was very mad. I was very angry. I almost lost my job to be honest, because of this, because of my attendance. We reached out to Frontier Airlines, and while we were at Asante's home, someone from Baggage Claim in Atlanta called. She just said she found my chair, honestly, so. Where is it? They said that it was in Atlanta. A Frontier spokesperson released this statement saying, we regret this unfortunate situation and extend our sincere apologies to the customer. We have located the wheelchair and we are working diligently to reunite the customer with the wheelchair. We are working to send it via overnight delivery. Thank you, Fox 75, honestly. Asante has a message for Frontier workers. Any kind of medical devices should not be treated like luggage. It actually should be priority. And Frontier says the wheelchair will arrive arrive here around one o'clock in the morning tomorrow and will be delivered to Asante's home after that. Reporting in Orlando, Valerie Boy, Fox 35 News.